Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, The Excelism. Today, I'm going to walk you through the process of downloading the latest update for Windows 11 to get the much talked about co-pilot feature on your system. So without further ado, let's jump right in. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the bell icon so you will never miss any update from us. Before we start with the downloading process, ensure that your PC meets the minimum system requirements for Windows 11. It's crucial for smooth update experience. First and foremost, backup all your essential data to avoid any unexpected loss during the update process. It's always better to be safe than sorry. Now, on your PC, go to the settings. Let me demonstrate here. Let me go to the settings. In the settings, you'll be having an option, Windows Update. If you can see in this section, the last option. If you can see into my Windows, I am up to date. In fact, I checked last today, 8.33 a.m. If at all, there is an update available, you will see an option here to download. If at all you are finding any, any update, I request you to install it. Just click on the button, download and install. The process may take some time depending on your internet speed. So, better grab a coffee while Windows gets updated. If you look into my Windows here, it's already updated. If I want to see the history of my update, I can go to the update history. Successfully installed 28.9 yesterday. Day before yesterday, I have downloaded the critical update, cumulative update preview for Windows 11 version 22H2, 64-bit based systems. This is very important. KB5030310. Once you download, this is what you will find it as the update. Once you download everything, you will be prompted to restart your PC. Go ahead and click on restart now. After you restart, your PC will be running the latest version of Windows 11 with Copilot. To access the Copilot, navigate to the system tray. Unfortunately, in my system tray, there is no option called Copilot. Co -pilot. Don't worry, you can just right click. There is an option, taskbar settings, just click it. In that, probably this might have been off. I request you to please keep it on. If you can see the name here, the Copilot preview. Preview means they had to release the full version of Copilot. But they have released to get the feedback from the people. They are going to add many functionality in the coming future. Once I make it on, once I close here, you can find here an option called Copilot Preview. Now, once you click this, you'll be having right side pane with the name called Preview Copilot with Bing Chat. Even if you go to the Bing, the AI functionality of the Bing is exactly same here. There are basically three types of conversation you can make with Copilot. One is more creative, the other one is more balanced, the other one is more precise. In fact, the name is very self-explanatory. I need not to explain much. You can start typing your question. It's going to give you the answer. Probably next coming videos, we will talk much case studies using this Copilot functionality. Before doing anything, let me just give you one single question so that let's see how this co-pilot is responding. Let me ask the question. Could you please disable the dark mode of my windows? It is just trying to process. It has given me a pop-up. Let me click S. Now the dark mode is gone. That's the beauty of Copilot. 
that's it folks you have now the latest windows 11 update along with the innovative copilot feature on your pc explore enjoy and let us know your thoughts on copilot in the comment section below if this video was helpful please hit the like button share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel the excelism for more technology tips and tutorials catch you in the next one in the meanwhile check out our other videos on windows 11 features and stay tuned for more technology tutorials coming your way thank you